What's up friends, Chuck here and welcome back to Resident Evil 2 HD Remake. Uh, okay, so, um, it's been about a week since I've played. Let's re-familiarise myself, and maybe you guys, even though it's been a day for you guys, with what's going on. Uh, in our box, we have some stuff. Nothing we need. Okay, good. Uh, we have these two power, pa power panel parts. God, try saying that eight times fast that we need to go install in the jail and we've got ammo for everything um so yeah now i did find i did have a comment on our uh, video recently saying that this is like hard mode and that all like the, the weapons like there's no ammo and then the weapons take up two slots and all that sort of stuff yeah it's true <laughs> um it is a lot harder ammo at the moment isn't too bad uh but the, yeah this playing the second time around i guess it would be the same for well i don't know I don't know if it's the same for Claire as well, like whether her grenade launcher is going to take up two slots, like whether it's the second time around, uh, everything is harder and the ammo is more scarce and there's more enemies and it's basically like new game plus harder, harder mode, uh, or whether Leon, no matter what, if you played him first, maybe it's the same, I don't know. Um, but we're not going to play through as Claire and then Leon and then start again as Leon and then Claire. We're just going to do the, the one playthrough. Uh, now what we are doing is, if I can remember how to map, there we go. We are going from here, we're going down these stairs, uh, and then we are going through here, and through here, through the parking garage, into the jail. That's what we're doing. But if I remember correctly, uh, there is, like, a million zombies out here. So, this is Matilda. I just gotta remember what, that's cool, cool guy gun, right? Cool kid gun. That's the Magnum. Okay, so, from memory, yeah, there's like a million zombies out here. Uh, uh, okay, let's try. Yep. We nailed it. I don't think we really need to come back to the police station for much. Um, the only thing we would need to come back for is... See, this is all blue. This is all done, right? And this is all done. And this is all done. And this is all done. So the only thing we would need to come back for is... Uh the pouch did we get the pouch maybe we got the pouch i've forgotten we may have already got the pouch from from the safety deposit box thing uh i've completely forgotten if we did or not so oh yeah this place uh so maybe that's a thing maybe we never have to come back i have actually forgotten if we've done that or not, whether we got both the buttons or, or not um okay there's dogs here now which is not not ideal uh, is that one dog or two i think it's two it is okay two Three, four, there we go, and one, two, three, good. We need to get through there. Uh, if there were zombies, I would have just run around them. Oh, god damn. But these guys, like, basically, they're dogs, right? So they chase you down and shit. If there were just, like, zombies, I would have just ran past. Alright, here we go. What is new in here? Is there going to be, like, some bullshit Wolverine or something? I mean, probably. Right. They, they do like to just throw the bullshit at you. Okay, this is blue, which means we don't need to do anything in here. Are you going to get up now? Alright, okay. So, the problem with this is, um, the Terminator was hiding in the walls, like a jerk. We can't get through here. Um, there's all these zombies. So, what, what's going to happen is... Is we're gonna go. We're gonna go here, we're gonna get the key card, we're gonna open it up. And we're gonna turn it on. This, for whatever reason, is not gonna open. And we're gonna have to do the gauntlet to get back to that other door. That's what's gonna happen. Um, which means we're gonna have to fight all of these zombies. So, should I pop them now? Or do we just wanna wait and see what happens? Maybe we wait and see what happens just in case. Because uh, that is gonna be a lot of ammo. So, yeah, we'll wait and see what happens. But this room is, um, red. So, there's probably lootables in here. But the lootable might just be, um, this key card and, and this thing. And then it might go blue. We'll see. Either way, we're going to have to do this mini game. I kind of fluked the, 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 this the last time. Because, I, like, I was just pressing buttons. Like, I mean, I, I understood it, but I kind of fluked it, right? So, let's see what we can do now. Uh, where do we need to get it to? Here. Okay. No, that's not going to work, is it? Alright. 
Oh god. That does nothing. So we need to turn it that way. And then that needs to go... Oh! Uh, okay. Let's have a think, alright? That goes there. What? Oh, you can turn this as well. Okay, that changes everything. <laughs> uh, does it do? Whoa! Okay. Let's, let's work on this one first. And let, let's see what happens. Uh, so that definitely needs to go that way. Okay. And that definitely needs to go... Well, that doesn't necessarily definitely need to go that way. Oh, shit, we did it. Well, we did one off. No, we did it. Good. Holy crap. I do not like that minigame at all. Um, it's, it's pretty confusing, but we nailed it. Alright, there is a letter here. There's also something in the toilet. Oh, next to the toilet. It's a first aid spray. Ben's memo. The station is swarming with monsters. Even here, I can hear the cries. But it's not the zombies I'm afraid of. No, it's the Terminator. Codename Tyrant. No, codename Terminator. The ultimate bioweapon. Uh, developed by those bastards in the utmost secrecy. Is Tyrant Terminator? I don't know. Like, I've, I've heard comments that he's called Mr. X. I don't know. I don't know what his name is. It's Terminator to me. Uh, that thing might be wandering around here. Chances they've already... Uh, they've ordered it to wipe out the witnesses. Okay. Well, it, it must be the Terminator, right? We now have a bit of inventory because uh, we got rid of those two power panels. So we can definitely pick that bad boy up. Can't really see what room that is. Definitely somewhere we can't get to. And it's not illuminated enough to see. Alright. My dead friend. Give me that parking permit. Huh? Huh? Ooh! Audio log. Audio log. Okay, Annette is Newt's mum. Right, that looks like Gillian Anderson a little bit. Uh, and we got the keycard. I've just thought about this. Before picking up the keycard, I should have done the power. Because picking this up is now going to... Um, my guess is at least is going to trigger something. Hmm. What are they after? What are they after? Is this blue? It is blue. Okay, so there's nothing in the zombies' cell. That's oh god. Bad. How did that just open? What if I press this? Okay, that opened that. That's not so bad. If I can walk through. Is this blue? All of this is blue. Oh shit, we're gonna have to ring around a posy pocket full of bullshit. Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. We've done it. For a hulking behemoth, he's not the best. Uh, okay, do we have... Do we have grenades? We have grenades, so we can get... We can get caught. We can chuck down a grenade. We can then run past. That's gonna... Blow up. And probably cause some shit. Then we need to come in here. That went a lot... Oh, no it didn't. <laughs> I was going to say, that went a lot better than I was expecting, but here's Terminator ruining the day. Is it Ada Wong? It is Ada Wong. Okay. Good. What's he got in his head? Oh, shit. That's not going to stop him, man. He's the fucking Terminator. Ada, this is getting old. Saving your ass, that's twice. One each cheek. I didn't realize you were keeping score. Look, this isn't a game. Oh, you Nothing dies down here. <laughs> that's still not going to kill him. And why? How did that just happen? Oh, right. That's how. You take it. You have the key card. Yeah. And this. I was hoping you could explain what's on it. Maybe. <laughs> yeah, it's a good point, actually. Can you explain Let's this? Uh, well, I haven't listened to it yet, shit lips, so maybe not. 
Also, I don't think the Terminator is dead. But if we are leaving the police station, um, it doesn't matter whether he's dead. He never comes back into it. So can we can we have a look? Is he like there? He's not there. There are zombies like rab ratting about there. Um, it was pretty good that this had nothing in it. That went way better than I was expecting. I was expecting, like I said, I was expecting to. Uh, I wasn't expecting the cells to open just by themselves. That was a bit bullshit. I was expecting to to use this power thing, this not to open, and all the cells to open, and then we would have to make the dash for cash through here to get up to here. To I don't know. I don't know what was going to be in here because obviously getting the key card meant that you were supposed to come back through here and use it here. Um, but anyway, it went better than I was expecting. Uh, but that may be the end of the Terminator, as far as like having to deal with him. But maybe not. Um, we'll see, I guess. Now, in Claire's story, we went to the orphanage, right? Can we duck? We can't duck. We just have to stand there and butt our heads against it. Uh, we went to the orphanage. With Leon's story, he didn't go to the orphanage, I don't think. So, he just heard about the secret lab underneath the, the thing and all that from that... Um, hang on. Let's go back to it. Uh, big fucking sinkhole in the city, which, by the way, rumor has it goes straight to your underground lab. So I guess we're going to the sinkhole in the middle of the city, in the city, and then going down to the lab. So he's just heard about that. I'm assuming we're going to go down, which means that he's probably going to have to go through the sewers as well, which means we're going to have to fight more water joes. So, um, yeah, the continuity, yet again, is not there. No. Ben didn't come through. Well, what exactly are you looking for? More info on the people... Okay, this is blue, so there's nothing to loot. Get in this, man! What about you? Trying to save the world? Always. Yeah, well, someone's gotta get word to the authorities. Gun shop kendo. We need reinforcements to save this city. Can we go into the gun shop kendo? Come on. Come on. Let me do it. Oh, you son of a bitch. Should we shoot the target? See what happens. Roads out. Going through that gun shop looks like the only way. Oh, we can go through gun shop kendo. Alright, we just couldn't do it. What happened here? Was that where no it wasn't. I was gonna say is that where the truck dude came in, but that's that's What are you doing? Oh she lock picked it. Good job. What a mess. Okay. Mess. There's definitely stuff in gun shop kendo. I wasted a bullet shooting at the thing. Ooh, what is this? Long barrel. Custom part for the W eight seventy, whatever that is. Up to uh, that's gonna be the it's gonna be that in there, and it's gonna make it uh, a double in it. Fuck, it is too. Greater muzzle velocity and less spread makes each shot more powerful. All right, this is gonna suck. Uh, may as well examine it. Okay, amazing. Combine. Uh. Alright, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Yeah. <laughs> of course. Of course. Far out, man. And then the Cool Kid Gun is going to get something. It's going to be double as well. Um, I don't know whether these are the four weapons that you're, like, whether you get more or something. Well, Claire, let's, let's think about it. Claire had the handgun. She had the SMG. She had uh, the grenade launcher. Was that it? They were the ones I remember using. Oh, she had the stupid spark gun, which was the most useless thing I've ever seen. That was it. And then at the end, she got minigun. So maybe we have these four, and at the end, we get something else. I don't know. It's all speculation. Unless you know, because you've played these games before, but I don't know. Um, oh, son of a bitch. However, I do like uh, Leon's weaponry more. Like, I've explained a few times now. In, I think even in this playthrough, but just in general, if you've been watching my channel for a while, or any of my Let's Plays for a while, uh, that I do really like uh, single target, single shot weaponry. So like pistols, sniper rifles, particularly bow and arrows, all that sort of shit. That's my, that's my shit, right? That's my jam. So I like Leon's weapon set, there we go, blue, more than Claire's. Because Claire had the, like the SMG thing. Oh, and she had like the grenade I'm launcher, which is bullshit. Move. It was so strong. Just passing through. I'm gonna ask you to lower that weapon. I kill you are. You gotta turn around and go right back out the way you came in. Oh, demon child. <clears throat> I 
think your daughter needs help, sir. Don't tell me how to deal with my daughter. This must Drop be Kendo. <clears throat> no! Wait! Step aside. We need to terminate her before she turns. She's turned already, man. She's gonna bite her dad in the ass. Look at it. I fucking daughter. Ada. Just let them be. Emma? Sweetheart, I told you to stay put. Bite him in the ass. Do it. Daddy. Oh. Daddy's here. Right in the neck. Did to us. Look, she got veiny neck and everything. You're cop. You're supposed to know something. How did this happen? Huh? Oh, blood eyes. She was a sweet little angel. Now she's a sweet little demon. Mommy. I was sleeping, honey. Okay. And I'm gonna. Put you to bed too, okay? How is it raining inside? Emma. Unless there's no roof. Oh shit. I'm gonna put you to sleep with a shotgun. To the face. Bite him in the shoulder. Can you imagine, man, having Just a daughter? Go. Just give us some privacy. Or, or, you know, wife, husband, best friend, anyone you care about, and then, like, having to do that, like, goddamn. <clears throat> you know, it's one thing to keep the truth from me, but why him? He shot himself, didn't he? I want to find out what's happening here, and stop whoever's behind it. Helping people like them? That's why I joined the force. My mission is to take down Umbrella's entire operation. We may not make it out. Well, we know we do. So. Whatever it takes to save this city. Count me in. Tell you what, the amount of stuff that Leon's been through already, zombies and like the Terminators punched him to the ground and like all this stuff and there's big explosions and all sorts of crap and he's still just looking dapper as shit in this suit, right? And he's got his hair, like he's still on point and stuff. What a beast. All right. Well, do we talk to Ada? Okay, we need to go through this. The Umbrella Corporation? We can't go talk to They're Kendo. Pharmaceutical company secretly making bioweapons. They have a virus. It turns people into indestructible mo monsters. That explains the horrible things I've seen. <laughs> no shit. <laughs> uh. Russian cuisine. And that's why I'm looking for Annette Birkin. She's the one at Umbrella yeah. responsible for unleashing the virus. I'm going to bring her down. I don't know much about Russian cuisine, actually. Okay, still blue. This is how we get to Annette. Based this on what you've said, we do. the sewer seems fitting. Well said. Alright, here we go. After you. Gee, thanks. Okay, with the remake and everything, they like Can't some of the voice acting is not the best. Down here. According to HQ, this leads right into Umbrella's secret facility. Come on, the sewers are run by the city. How could they have a facility without the authorities knowing? Welcome to corporate America. Umbrella's controlled Raccoon City for years. Okay, Q. Some water jars, right? There's got to be loot in here somewhere. There we go. Because it's red. Nice. Now blue? Yes. Having to check the map every four seconds to make sure like you've got everything is kind of... Crap. Oh, that's not... What the hell? Is that a crocodile? It had a crocodile tail, but it looked furry. We got a furry crocodile on the loose. That's... Something, I guess. Alright, save room. Perfect. We don't need to put in... Oh, well, I guess we put away that. Uh, actually. 
probably want now we're in the the sewers right probably want like a poison one <clears throat> um yeah fairy crocodile i don't know whether it was fur or not it looked fur looked fur that's a bad sentence it looked like fur um but it also had a it was definitely a crocodile tail because i had like the ridges or it was like a dragony type thing but I, I don't think there's dragons in resident evil right because everything's mutated so like you know they're like the cliche um the cliche stories of like there being a crocodile in the sewers and stuff or alligators in the sewers it's probably that right it's probably a play on that it's like an alligator down here that got mutated in like huge and probably got like three heads and stuff uh, which makes sense why all this stuff is like bent out of shape and, and like massive holes and and all that. I thought these um, pipes were like scratch marks, but they're not. All right, so we're going through here, I guess. Uh, so the alligator thing would have gone straight through here because there's no way it's gone upstairs and stuff because it was humongous. So we'll see what's in store. Get your torch out. Don't get your torch out. See if I care. Now, what's going to be interesting is if we go through the exact same part of the sewers that Claire was in or not. Uh, at the moment, it's nowhere near the same. Again? It's not too late to turn back, <clears throat> But maybe uh, there's like a door that leads to it or something? You're stuck with me to the end. You want some Ada action. And uh, she's pretty boss, so like... Or I was going to say, or fall down Ugh. into a into a place, so that makes sense. As well. You sure this is the right way? <clears throat> Unfortunately. Oh, she's gonna. Oh. Wait there. Here comes alligator friend, crocodile friend. Oh. Is it a crocodile? I can't tell, no, man. Yeah, not a bad call. Yeah, it's a crocodile. Okay. Uh, he's snapping at... We'll call him Snappy Tom. Right? Because he's, he's like snapping his jaws at... Oh, God. Yeah, it... Oh, Jesus. Alright. Yeah, Snappy Tom is angry. Dodge. He's, he's not the smartest, the old Snappy Tom. Like, he could have got us... He could have got us right there. Flammable! Shoot it! Okay, it was fur. Chew on that, you overgrown <laughs> son of a bitch. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that was cringe fucking plus. Uh, okay, so it was kind of fur. I, I do have the. Is that Ada? It is okay. Leon, up here. Um, I do, I do have the have the settings at, at like lower, right? Because uh, we, we've talked about that already earlier in the playthrough. But it looks like fur, right? So it was kind of well, it's like it's not fur. It's like sticks and and, and shit. But it looks like fur. So I was kind of right. So it was a furry crocodile uh, named Snappy Tom, and uh, he's he's done so. Poor Snappy Tom, rip. Okay. Oh, I see you. Sneaky. Uh, that's kind of disappointing. That that was like a one-time affair. That like, you know, they, they could have. I guess they're going with the. Can't say I didn't warn you. Oh god, it was huge. You said the virus turned people into monsters, not reptiles. Fair point. I'm just impressed you made it in one piece. Okay, I'm trying to have a conversation. Thank you. Um, yeah, they're sticking to the original, right? Remake and all that. So that must have been what happened in the original. But, uh, it's kind of disappointing that they have this, like, cool thing, right? Um, and then, like, it's a one-time thing. That, like, it would have been good if you, like, chased you around and stuff. Kind of like if you played Batman Arkham Asylum. Um, like, Killer Croc. Where you go through the sewers and, like, Killer Croc just chases you the whole time and stuff. It would have been cool if that was, like, it was around more. Because now that's, like, a really cool set piece and it's done. Unless there's more of them, but I highly, highly doubt that. Uh, we did blow his face so apart, which is pretty good. Umbrella sells monsters like that to who? Our military? Somebody else's? They don't sell the monsters. They sell the viruses that make them. And Annette is who makes the viruses. 
scary as that alligator was, the net is far more dangerous. Alright, what do we got? As if you wouldn't open this. Come on! What is this place? What is this place? It doesn't say what it is. Okay. Uh, well. I guess we're just going through this gate. Save point? Save point. Okay. So, this is a, um, you've beat Snappy Dom. Snappy Tom, congratulations. Save point. Okay, we had 57 saves for Claire. So, if we're going on a similar kind of trajectory as far as saves go, we're, what, like halfway? I think this is episode 7 or something of, of Leon's, and I think we had 17 of Claire's. So, going by that, we're a little under halfway. So we're saving more than we did with Claire? I don't know. Who knows? There she is. Jenny and Anderson herself. Annette Birkin. She's who we're looking for? Not much time. Need to dispose of it. We're here for the G-Virus. Huh. That's not gonna happen. I'm warning you, Doctor. Oh, yeah? Hey! Stop! Oh, we got shot! You'll never get the G-Virus! What a bitch. Didn't expect that from a scientist. Uh, Leon. Forget about me. Just go. Stop her before she gets away. Oh. Do we play as Aiden now? Oh, well, we did play as Nude, right? So I guess we play as Aiden. <clears throat> oh, hello. I'm right outside the facility in pursuit of Annette. Why did she get rid of her coat? To keep him warm? But, it's not oh, her. no wonder he's after Ada. Oh, damn. Once it's in hand, I'll call for extraction. Okay. This is the old school approach, which you is can still. Run, Annette, but you can't hide. Okay. Uh, this is the old school approach, which is still being um, used today of like, let's put a badass female protagonist in the game and all the rest of it, but like have her wear like skimpy shit. Right, so like if you were going into a zombie infested place and you were running around and you were shooting zombies and running away from zombie dogs and all this sort of stuff, you would not wear like a clingy like dress thing um, or you know other games where like you're some badass like a uh, female warrior or something and you've got you've got like short shorts on and, and like a, a just a, a bra basically like come on wear appropriate things also high heels like take that shit off it's like the new jurassic park right jurassic park um the first one uh jurassic world sorry <clears throat> the first of the two um the, the the female main main female lead um wears high heels through the whole movie like running through jungles and stuff like come on <laughs> let's be let's be real here all right so we've got a ladder there and we have a door here not a door a lift the lift she doesn't work so we're gonna have to get some oh we're gonna have to get some power going uh, I guess she gave him a jacket to keep him warm, right? But he got shot in the shoulder, I think. Like, I don't think you're going to go into shock and all that sort of stuff from, like, a shoulder. I don't know. I've never been shot, so. And I don't intend to. Unless it's, like, with a, um, immunization or something. Ooh! EF, EMF visualizer. EMF. The EMF visualizer track wiring and hat. Okay. Uh, to track wiring and hack electronic equipment. Okay, it has unlimited ammo, so that's all. Secret awesome. weapon time. Oh shit! Talking about Arkham Asylum. Look at this. So we hack this bad boy. Imagine if that's how hacking really worked. Like people just walked around with a hacking gun and just shot stuff. So that's made the power, right? That did not make the power. 
that just turned on the wind turbine. Uh, okay, so we can't go up the ladder anymore. Do we want to turn this off? Can we now go up the ladder? No. Okay, so we, want, we definitely want to turn this on then. Oh, right, let's see. <clears throat> this is ridiculous. <laughs> uh. Candy from a baby. Okay, she's pretty badass though, but this is ridiculous. We have, what is this weapon? What, maybe we should uh, examine this. What is this? A broom! She got a broom handle. Nine shot capacity, nine millimeter, double action, semi-auto hang. That is a mouthful. Semi-auto, damn it. This piece is also uh, is one of a spe specific limited run of five thousand pistols. Okay. Righto. It's pretty cool looking, I guess. We only have nine ammo, which is not a lot. Okay, there is some buglets. Uh, we're gonna have to bring out the old. Uh, we can't. Why can't we? We're gonna have to put this on first. Nope. Can't do that either. There we go. <laughs> Alright, now we need to... Do a kaboom. Can we do it through a wall? No. Okay, there we go. You would not stand there. Like, those blades are gonna go flying and stuff. Maybe we'll go down before we... Okay, we're gonna have to get rid of this guy. Okay, he's definitely dealt with, which is good. September inspection, week one. I assume that means September. I already put in a request last week, but we absolutely must have a replacement ID wristband ASAP. We need to gain access to certain areas of the main facility. In other words, me and my crew can't get past pieces. Uh, can't get past. Can't get to the places we need to in order to do our jobs right now. So I don't want to hear anyone accusing us of slacking off. Well, you're slacking off now because you don't have a head. Uh, okay, so if we bring out our fancy pants, what does this do? That locks that, right? That unlocks that and puts power to this. And this one goes. What did that do? I have no idea what that did. Okay, well, apparently it was needed to do, so who knows? Uh, let's go through. Oh, now it's locked. So now we need to turn this off. Okay, six bullets. Probably shouldn't tag people uh, because they're going to get up and, and be active. And we don't have the bullets to, to deal with them. Sounds like someone's pushing around a, a bin down there. All right, bulletin, which is good. Who is pushing around a bin? Okay, this guy has activated. Let us deal with him. Oh, he's a fatty too. He takes some shots. Holy crap. <clears throat> Alright, we got five in reserve. There's this guy. Are you going to get up? Yes. Sit down. Sit down. My god. What the shit? There we go. Holy crap. Alright. We have none in reserve. There's Fatty. 
we probably could have got away without using any bullets, thinking about it. Uh, has she, seriously, she just got back up. We've put like a hundred in her face. She has, what a bitch. It's the strongest zombie in the game so far, hands down. We're just we're not gonna bother we don't have enough ammo what are we doing in here we don't we don't even know i guess we're getting to the end here okay we've got some bullets to make up for it 15 it's not bad actually and we have a flash grenade so if we get grabbed we're okay uh that is everything so now we just need to backtrack so i wonder what the point of going down here was well we, we we've got more bullets than what we started with so that's good but yeah we definitely could have got through here without spending any ammunition is that, is that fatty? It is. Okay. <laughs> Fuck you, fatty. Up we go. Not up we go, that's red. Oh, we're gonna have to use this stupid thing. Oh, friggin' hell. Alright, well, fatty. Sounds about it. Okay, let's just pop you once and run past. I didn't even think to do this while we were over here. Okay, strongest zombie of all time. Damn it. Makes sense now that, you know, you go all the way through here to get ammo. It's like, eh. But there's this stuff to deal with. Okay, now to backtrack. Should be able to just run past them. Fatty, maybe not. Oh no, we got it. Also, you would run a lot faster. Take off your shoes. Or at least snap the we uh, wheels, heels off. Got you now. She didn't see us? Okay, well she's blind as Always shit. Good at running, Annette. I'll give you that. <sighs> Okay, this is blue. Don't need to worry about it. She went in here, didn't she? This is a dead end. Oh, come on! Okay. Bastard, aren't you? So much for... That, that didn't work? Oh, God. Oh, God. Nope. Oh, shit. We're definitely taking a hit here. And... No, we're not. We're gods. Okay. Um, so we need to go back out here. Is it this? It's not this. Am, am I, am I right in doing this? I'm not. Oh, we're, we're definitely taking a hit here. Oh shit, it was a good one too. Okay. Because we can't get back down. What am I missing here? Oh, I, I'm, I'm... Oh, okay. Over here. Got it. Ow. The one place I didn't look. <clears throat> uh, do we have a heal? We don't. So that's not perfect. Uh, we can't go out there because we'll get hit. Oh, no. Not good. Alright, well, if we die, at least we know where we're going next time. Yeah, it's done too. <laughs> Alright. It was the only place I didn't look. Please don't put me back at the start. Please don't. Most weapons are but pea shooters before the mighty tyrant. Okay, we're here. Uh, probably a good time to end the episode too, because... Um, we're at 40 minutes. <clears throat> so we'll come back, we'll do this, and we'll see what's next. Either way, hopefully you enjoyed it. 
As always, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. If you like this video, click here to see another one just like it. If you're new to the channel and like what I'm doing, click here to subscribe and become the newest member of the Chicken Coop. If you really like what I'm doing, you can find a link to my Patreon in the description, where you can help support me and help the channel grow. You'll also find a link to the channel's Discord server where you can chat with me and other members of the Chicken Coop. And don't forget to hit that notification bell.